one shot, man. It was a rainy afternoon in August, August 21st, 1981 to be exact. I decided to take a stroll down my sidewalk, my target location, Taco Bell. As I walked in the door, I was greeted with the smell of <laughs> approaching the register, I began to order. I'll have the usual. I've literally never seen you before. How the fuck am I supposed to know what you want? You so Fuck you, bitch. Just give me the munchies. As I uttered those words, a short man, about 5'1", enters the joint. I tried to make out his face, but the flash of lightning behind him shined off his head and blinded me. He took out his phone and began approaching me. He threatened to cancel me for being so mean to a hard-working employee and for disrespecting a woman. Whoa, chill man. Why don't you back off before this gets ugly? As soon as this sentence left my mouth, he began running around me. I'm fast as fuck, boy! I felt him ready to strike at any moment. As soon as I felt him almost initiate his attack, he spotted someone out of the corner of his eye that made him stop dead in his tracks. Alex! I knew this would get ugly. I had to get out. I couldn't break up this fight. If I stayed, I wouldn't only be obliterated in battle, but worse, I could receive a strike. Alex dropped his quesarito from Taco Bell TM and stood up to face the gnome. Keemstar began charging his attack, the ground crumbling under him. I had only seen videos of this battle at the academy, but now I was experiencing it for real. I knew what was coming next. This would be their final encounter, their final battle, the world's final moments. As the word left his mouth, there was a blinding white light and then silence. Nick I could feel, I could hear, ringing. I looked up, and Ethan from the critically acclaimed podcast, H3H3, had absorbed the blow. But now, from the sheer power of the slur, Ethan was condemned to be forever a furry.